This is Twit. So we talk a lot about Google Assistant. We talk a lot about Bixby over at Apple. We talk about Siri. Um, have you ever wanted a voice-controlled assistant that was not developed by one of those major companies? Maybe was open source. Maybe was super lightweight and customizable. Well, wait no longer. It's called Say. It's called Say. Uh, S A I Y, and it's actually a rebuild of the app that was previously called Utter. U T T E R. Oh, yeah. If you remember Utter, yeah. yeah. So the develop, so the developer of Utter rebuilt uh, Utter from the ground up, renamed it to Say, and it's basically an open source uh, Google Assistant type uh, app that you can use on your phone with no hooks into any major company type thing, and you can customize the heck out of it. Right. So just a quick rundown of what it can do. Um, it does a wake up phrase. It will talk to you. Um, it you know, it, you can control your phone. You can control, you know, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and airplane mode and all that sort of stuff. You can have it search the web. You can choose the search engine it searches. You can have it post to Twitter. You can have it read back to your text message. It does all the things, all those other, it does all the things those other assistants do. But it's completely developer driven and open source. It even lets you turn on the uh, your torch or your uh, the light on the back of your phone by just saying to turn it on. So as Jason's here, he's he's um, he's you know kind of browsing around. Basically, the app runs. It's very lightweight and it runs in the background. On the home screen, you start off with doing a voice tutorial at the top, and that's how you train it to learn your voice, like you do with Google Assistant, right? There's a nifty user guide that, in to be honest, is. It's great that the links are in there, but when you click through to them, they go to uh, his forum post on the XDA developers forum, and there's some of the user guide where he's like, coming soon. Right. So like, don't link to it unless it's there yet, right? But um, under command list, uh, you can go through and you can specify all the various commands that you want, um, that you know, the various keys or the other com uh, voice commands you want to you want to do. You can set your name. You could te you could have it call you something every time. Currently, it's set to call you master. Um, but you can change oh, it to whatever you want, my. and it's it basically it works. It's just an open source uh, voice assistant app. Hmm. I'm impressed. Um, I could go through all the custom. If you go, if you hit on the menu, the hamburger menu, there's customization oh, uh, under custom. Yeah, a lot isn't of, this crazy? A lot of commands. So yeah, go to go to uh, hit the hamburger menu and go to customization. It, I mean, you could get lost in customizing this sucker, but yeah, that first one, custom name, you can change it to say Jason. It could be J Dog. It could be, you know, whatever you want to, you know, whatever you want to go by. What's up, J Dog? <laughs> J Dog. Um, <laughs> J Diddy. Yeah. So there, we'll do that. Um, you could change the the intro when it responds to you. You could say you could tell it what you want it to say to you, and you could set different ones and use them randomly. Like it is so cool. There's so much that you could do with this. Um, and of course, it's got Tasker integration, so you could have it. You know, when you um when you have certain uh events that are happening via Tasker, you can tie them into say or say and control them that way. Um. If you want the open source life, this is pretty. This is this is the one you want to. This is the one you want to use. That's what it boils down to. So, nice. so it's called Say. Um, it's free in the Google Play Store. There are ads. You can donate um, via in-app purchase, and that will turn off the ads. Um, if you want to support support your developers as well, um, I love the fact that there's a uh, there's a guy who is doing this. Like he's committed to making an open source uh, voice assistant. So different levels to donate. You can buy him some coffee or buy him dinner and that sort of thing. Ten um, coffees, yeah. even. As we as we say, as Flo says often, support your devs, mm -hmm. and and I, I I strongly support that. I bought him a beer, so uh, yeah. Um, say it's free in the Google Play Store. If you want an alternative to the Google Assistant or to Bixby or any of the other ones, check it out. So that's awesome. I'd never heard of this before. Yeah. Love cool. it. But now you have. Now I have. Now what will I do with it? It's called Say, S-A-I-Y, and it is free. Say away, say uh, away, say away. No, it's not called sale. 